Hey guys, thanks for checking out another awesome knife. Uh, before I begin, I wanted to just shout out thanks for everybody checking out my videos. I'm almost to a thousand subscribers. So if you're watching this video, just take one second and hit subscribe. I'm at 987. I'm hoping with this video, it'll push me to a thousand and then I can make a whole bunch more videos. Uh, what we're looking at here is probably the best knife you can buy, period, anywhere for the money. This is the Mora Knife 511 High Carbon, made in Sweden. And look at this thing. Just look at it. I mean, that is amazingly awesome. I mean, just on looks alone, you should get this knife. Now, if I go through the rest of this review and tell you how good it is, you should buy about five of these. Uh, this thing is unbelievable. So uh, when you buy it, it comes from Amazon usually. This is um, the package that it comes in, a little uh, a little thing, and then they put this in a box, obviously, but this is what it actually came in. This is the Mora Knife Basic 511 in red, and it actually has a really nice sheath. This is a red plastic sheath. This is some more... Uh, model number information. You can see it's made in Sweden. More knives have been making knives since 1891. 1891. So they've been around a while. They know what they're doing. It's got a wonderful hole in case there's water. These can actually be clipped to other knives. So if you have other more knives, you could stack them. Really cool feature. And uh, this knife here, it is about three and a half inches long. It's 3.6 inches to be exact. And total length is 8.25 inches. And the knife weighs about 3.9 ounces. One thing I'll mention about this blade, they did not grind the spine of the knife. So if you get this, um, if you want to use it for a lot of stuff, if you want to use this to start um, fires with a fire steel, take some sandpaper or a block of wood in sandpaper and grind that off or your grinder, sand or whatever. That way you can use it to actually um, start a fire. I'll give you some up close views. More knife made in Sweden carbon. Uh, this is just by far the sharpest knife you can get out of the box from any knife manufacturer. And at the end of this review, I'm going to go through some sharpening tests and prove to you that it is actually one of the very, very sharpest knives that you can get, period. Now, the blade grinding, look at this, how they do this. They grind it. It's a flat grind, and then they grind about quarter inch down so it's almost like a saber grind this allows the knife to perform extremely well if you're cutting wood branches anything that you're cutting it'll do a great great job just due to the the grinding i'm going to talk a little bit about the handle um, in recent years they've they've redone this so i mean this is what they are calling an impact resistant plastic slash rubber they say tpm but it's basically a plastic um, this particular one feels more like plastic than than rubber so but it's impact resistant look at the nice colors i mean this is just an amazing and there are different color options you can get so they have different ones blue black green orange and blue all different color combinations i'll put the links in at, right in the description so you can buy it directly make it real simple for everybody just click the link in the description and you can get this knife pick out the color you want i am in no way affiliated with mora or any distributor or anything so i do not get um, anything from them for free i had to buy this myself i've been using mora knives for years and years they make many different ones um, these are excellent knives for camping for hunting for just having in your pack um, for the price ten dollars you can't get a better knife than this and it has a lifetime warranty on top of it uh, one thing I'll, I'll mention and other people have said this too they make these little ranger bands i didn't get one for this video but you just wrap that around it's like a big rubber band type thing but a lot better and it'll keep that even more secure it's fairly secure just in there but get that band and uh and that'll even make it make it better now onto the sharpness stuff so I just wanted to show you, this here is a brand new Benchmade Osborne. This is about a $250 knife. Never even been used. This is the first time that I'm ever taking it out um, 
and testing it. And I'm just gonna show you what this looks like. This is a special knife from Benchmade, super heavy duty knife. I've never ever used this knife, ever. And I just wanna show you the edge a little bit, if I can get that to focus. This knife here, I mean, it is factory ground from, from Benchmade, never been used. And what I have here is a special testing machine. This is called the BESS uh, Certified Tester. And what this does is it uses these little clips. These are these little clips here. And I've been testing out various knives and everything else um, to test the sharpness of knives. And so I'm going to show you what we do. So this is the little test media. And what we're going to do is we put that in here just like so tear it out and we're going to test. We're going to test how sharp is the Benchmade knife and then we're going to test out how sharp is the Mora. And I'm going to prove to you just how sharp this looks a little wonky. Okay. So, here we go. We're going to test this Benchmade out and we're going to see how sharp it is. 109. That's pretty good. Now, we're gonna test it out again. We're gonna do three tests for each each knife. Do another one. One nineteen. Well, it was below 119. I'll do one more just for just for safe just for safe measures. I'll tear it out and I'll do one more. One oh four. That puppy's gotten good. So anything below two hundred is considered really, really good. Now we're gonna do the more knife. This here is a $10 knife, and I'm gonna show you the sharpness that you get for $10. Will it beat the Benchmade? $160, interesting. One sixty again. Okay, this might not have been a fair competition. <laughs> picked the, I picked a little bit too sharp of a knife. One sixty two. So, what I wanted to tell you was, it's very close to a two hundred and fifty dollar knife. And just to give you guys even more, even more of a idea for how sharp that is, this is a standard um, utility razor blade. And I actually went through and I've sharpened tons and tons of these. And this is brand new one, brand new blade. And I'm gonna show you what the brand new, brand new razor blade goes for on one of these things. Just so you can see how sharp that knife is compared to an actual, an actual, um, ready? Here we go. One sixty nine. So this more knife is sharper than the sharpest razor blades out of the box. The only one sharper than Stanley is Milwaukee and Milwaukee came in at 152. 152. So this knife here is super 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 sharp. I mean it's just incredible. It's, it's sharper than a factory edge razor, you know, basically utility knife razor blade. So for 10 bucks, you can't go wrong, you guys, getting this knife. I highly, highly recommend it. 
Um, click the links in the description, comment. Let me know what you guys are using these for. I know a lot, most people use them for camping, hiking, boating, fishing, um, skinning their big game, whatever it is. For 10 bucks, you can't go wrong with this thing. I mean, it really does a heck of a job. Highly recommend it. Thanks a lot for checking out this vid and make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, look for more videos coming out real soon. Have a great day. Bye.